How are you, buddy? Everybody's back here. 2019 resolutions. The theme of the week. Now, some of you just heard that and said, Rabbi Zach, I just started liking your videos. Why do I got to go talk about resolutions? Some of us, resolutions are a little daunting. We have a history of trying to make resolutions and usually not panning out. So when it comes to a new year, we're kind of nervous about change and making resolutions. What do we do about that? It's an amazing Talmud I want to share with you in the Gemara. The great rabbi, Rabbi Shimon Ben Gamliel. Shimon Ben Gamliel said about himself, he said he looked around Nobody honored their father as much as he did. So since you look around, the way I treat my father, nobody, nobody even comes close until he discovered the behavior of Asav. Now Asav was the evil, hateful brother of Jacob, of Jacob, our forefather. Even though Asav did horrible things, there was one thing that he did better than anybody, was honoring his father. Shimon said, you know why he was so much better than me? Because even though I serve my father all the time, I don't do it like Asaph. Because whenever Asaph serves his father, he has special clothing. He always changes into his special clothing. He has a special suit saved just for him. I don't do that. I don't have special clothing. I just serve my father. So bizarre, Rabbi Shimon Leal. You want to serve your father in the utmost way. And you know Asaph did it better than you because he had a suit. So I have a great idea. Why don't you go get a special clothing just to serve your father in? And you could be just like Asav. Rishir Gamaliel says an amazing lesson for us to realize when it comes to change. Yeah, Rishir Gamaliel, I want to serve my father the best way. But I know that if I have a special suit and it gets dirty while I serve my father, it's going to bother me. I'm not on that level like Asav. I'm not as great. So even though I could accomplish that, I know where I am, I know where I'm holding, it's not for me. When we look at our lives and we try to change, sometimes we don't take into factor that we have realistic, normal limitations. We can't just accomplish whatever we want to accomplish just because we want to accomplish it. We have to take the time to really think, what do I want to accomplish? Why do I want to accomplish? And how am I going to accomplish it? Only after those thoughts can a person and still challenging to accomplish so much. Let's take that time this year. Really think about it. What do we want to do? Maybe ask a friend of what he thinks or she thinks we should do. With that type of thought and preparation, God willing, 2019, we can look back and say, wow, this year I changed for the good. Take care.